parking brake off? Good. Nothing coming? Let's get on out there and let's go see if we can get carcass on. I'd like to see it before I have to go out and start mowing. Because I'm already late on the mowing. I'm very late on the mowing. So let's see what we can do about getting this part of the trip done before it gets dark. Nothing after that one, thank God. But I don't think we'd have been able to stop it. All right, we need to merge again, and it's all clear. But we're gonna take the next right, head on over there toward Toulouse. Oh, Barcelona. Nice. A little too early to turn our blinkers on. We ain't quite there yet. Keep right. There and we then go. Exit right. Exit right. Now part of it, we should, if we get close enough to see old old uh, Carker Zone, we should be close enough that it, it, it'll give us a, it'll give us an achievement when we do. Cause it's one of the sightseeing, it's one of the sightseeing achievements for, for France. So my biggest thing now is whether or not there's gonna be a place we can turn around before we get to Toulouse or we're gonna have to drive all the way to Toulouse. That'd be a pain. That would be a pain in the tuckers. That'd be, that'd be, you know, why I turned off detours all the time ago, a year, year and two years ago, whenever they put detours into the game. Well, I've got them turned down so they are almost off because they were such a pain in the butt. Six o'clock. All right, let's keep driving. See if we can get our speed up a little bit because we want to get there and see it during the daytime. Some birds up ahead, see the buzzard circling, see the hot air balloon. Hopefully, maybe that hot air balloon is just watching. Maybe that's some tourists taking a look at taking a look at the city over there, the little city state carker zone over there, you know. Seeing anything? Still not seeing anything. Nothing on either side of us. Whoa! Oh, there it is, there it is, look at there. Look over there to our side. Awesome! There's Carker's home, people. Don't look like we can pull over. I bet we can pull into this rest stop over here, though. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna see if there's a spot we can pull over. Achievement progress, landmark tour, two of six. We're gonna pull on up here and then I'm gonna go into photo mode. And we'll go out and we'll see if we can't take a look out here. Never mind, I'll find a new route. Thank you, find a new route, find us a new route. Right, I'm gonna pull right up here. There it is, all righty. Let's put the brake on. Let's pop out. There it is off in the distance there. Carker's on. All right, tell you what, we are gonna go into photo mood. And that'll at least let me pull around. And I'm gonna get a screenshot of it too. Pull around, zoom on up. Isn't that a gorgeous? Isn't that a beauty out there? Let's see, how far back can we swivel? And how far up can we go? Looks like that's as high up as we can go. It's a shame I can't I can't put it into like fly mode right now, or I'd fly on out there and take a look at it. But we're gonna put a screenshot. There we go. And in fact, while we're at it, 
Let's see, can I go into fly mode? Let's see. Um, is it G underline fly mode? Hmm. I'll have to take a look. Anyway, let's turn this off. Let's turn that off like that. And next time, maybe I'll fly on out there once I take a look. But I have got to get out and do some stuff. Doesn't that look just like the? Doesn't that look just like the the board game out there? Isn't that just so precious? All right, folks. I told y'all we were gonna make a carcass zone, and maybe next time I'll even even have it in fly zone, and we'll take a look out there and see what it looks like. All righty. All right, folks, as y'all see here, I'm going into fly mode, and all this stuff right here is recorded in post-processing, because whenever I came back and recorded, I just, I didn't happen to notice a little red light was blinking on my Yeti over here, which meant that it was in mute. So we've gone into developer mode, gone into to developer camera, and went into fly mode, and we're going to fly out across the field here, and come on over here and take a look at the castle and all. And someday we might even, you know, come and see if we can teleport our truck over here and maybe drive around on these little roads over here. Ooh, look at there! Isn't that something? I like the job they've done on that castle. It's pretty darn detailed for the fact that it's, uh, it's just a castle about a kilometer away from the road there, so you don't really, you know, you got all those, all those buildings up inside there that are detailed, and they didn't really need to be that. So we're going to hop back in. You just go to another camera, and there you are. You hop right back into your truck, and we'll be getting on out of here. So that was our little Carcassonne detour. I'm glad y'all enjoyed it. Glad I was able to go get my other keyboard. You see where we are right there? It's on the road from, I think, Marcier up to Toulouse is where that is. And as you see, I'm trying to find a place. Maybe we can come up here and turn around, but you Europeans ain't like that. You Europeans got those dang... Those dang dividers, those big old metal guardrail dividers between it. So I ended up driving all the way to Toulouse and had to come back. But it's okay because it was worth it. It was worth it to go out there and see Carcassonne out there on the side. So that's it. And I hope y'all enjoyed our little detour here. Oh, isn't it pretty out yonder? Hope y'all enjoyed our little detour. And our next little detour we're going to do is whenever I'm in Barcelona. I'm going to show y'all some of Barcelona down there. Look at them castles out there. That makes me want to play Carcassonne again. I'm going to have to get that game out. We'll see y'all next time. And this is G-Bub saying, thank you for coming with me.